Yo, yo, what's poppin', everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Mike Gomes. Today's everybody's favorite. Everybody loves seller calls. Everybody loves listening to live seller calls. Everybody's like, Mike, can you call my seller? Can you call my seller? Can you call my seller? I'm like, yes, let me call them. Shoot me a DM at the Mike Gomes if you want me to call your seller. Today's seller call was fun. Like, you got to have fun with these things, right? Like, crack jokes, smile, laugh. This is what sales is. Sales should be fun. So watch this video. It's going to be dope. You're going to see a fun live seller call. Before we do that, please like the video, subscribe to the channel. Now let's get into it. Let's go. Hello. Hey, what's going on, John? What's this about? Um, the property in Rutland. My my guy Felipe was telling me about it. Hang on a second. Let me talk to somebody here. I know what he wants. Hello. Hi. Who's this? Hi. He told me to find out what you want. I love it. Well, my name's Mike. Um, my sales manager Felipe was telling me about this property, saying that you guys were looking to sell it. Hold on. You have property in Rutland that you're looking to sell. I might sell it if I get the right price, but I'm not out in the hurry to sell it, though. No. Did you hear him? Um, Kind of. He said he might sell it if he gets the right price, but he's not, like, in a hurry to, uh, looking to sell it really now. Okay, that makes sense. Well, what's going on with the house? He wants to know what's going on with the house. I got a tenant in there. It's been a thousand a month. He has a tenant in there that pays him rent. Okay. Okay, cool. So 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 if he sold it, what would happen with the tenants? So if he sold it, what would happen with the tenants? They'd probably have to leave. Whatever you want to do to them, they'd have to rent it to them. I don't know. Yeah, I guess that would have to be up to you. Okay, that makes sense. Are, are they on board with, with um somebody selling the house or? Are they on board with you selling the house? Uh, not yet. I haven't talked to him about it. He hasn't talked to them about it, so he's not no, sure. People have been offering me. I haven't offered them, you know. It's just yeah, people, call people are calling him, but yeah. he hasn't really, you know, had anything worth his while to be interested in. Okay. Well, what do you think would get him interested? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just his friend. What would get you interested? One hundred twenty thousand would get me interested. One hundred and twenty. Okay, great. So, so what does the property need for work? If we were gonna like fully renovate it, what does it need if they needed to renovate it? It might need a tight tank. A tight a tank, tank, whatever that is. A stress pool that works fine, but I don't know if it has a. He has a cesspool that works fine, but he doesn't know if it'll pass uh what, what title V? Yeah, title five. Oh, title five. Oh, okay. So might need something to do with that. Okay. Yeah. So sometimes with, with the title five, it gets a little bit tough because what we do with the properties is we'll resell them to a retail buyer, and that retail mm -hmm. buyer will go out and get a conventional loan. And that cesspool will kind of kill the deal for them. They won't be able to get approved. So we'd have to put in that tight tank for sure, which kind of hurts us on the on the purchase price. Um, yeah, well, he's not in any hurry to sell it. Okay. I mean, what what happened if we just bought the house outright without him having to deal with anything, anything with the cesspool or anything like that, and we bought it on his timeline? I mean, where's the lowest he would go on this thing without paying any commissions or something? What's the lowest you would go without paying any commissions or something? Or what? What? What was the rest of that question? Uh, like one twenty. One twenty. That's what he wants as it sits. Mm. Okay. Yeah, we're we're probably going to be a little bit off of that. Um. I mean, what what are his plans with the property if he doesn't sell it? I'm sorry. What are his plans with the property if he doesn't sell it? It's too much. What, what are your plans with the property if you don't sell it? You're going to keep a tenant in there, right? Yeah, I'm going to yeah. keep the tenant in there. Yeah, he's just going to keep the tenant in there. 
Okay, well, what what happens if we ended up getting his one twenty, and um, we made him our bank? We're talking about buying it, but we're sick of doing it. That's all. No. I, what ha- what happens if you get him the one twenty? What? What if we can get him the one twenty, but we pay him off over time for the one twenty, and we make him a bank? He wants to know what if they make you a bank and pay you off the one twenty over time. No. No, he's not interested in that. Why not? I don't know, but uh, can can you call him back at another time? Like, I'm just his friend take, taking the phone call for him because he can't hear good. Got it. You're one of the greatest friends anybody could ever have. Am I? For sure. I mean, if... Okay, well, I, I would be a much better friend if I could get him his 100 and why. I know what what can we do to get what can we do to get this deal done together? Because I feel like me and you can work this thing out. Put 120 in his hand. That's Dang what it, we man. can do. Like he's not gonna budge. And I don't know anything else to tell you. That's a great restaurant, by the way. Fins and Tails. And great you pick restaurant. and you pick out his restaurants. You are you are a wonderful friend. <laughs> I love okay. it. Okay, yeah. So, I I mean, we're probably going to have to be, if we bought this property, somewhere around the $80,000 mark. And, I I mean, I don't think that's going to get him excited. Uh, Yeah, no, I don't think so either. I mean, when you're talking, I'm having 40 grand. Yeah, I mean, why was he selling the property in the first place? Or thinking about it? Why were you thinking about selling that property? I trust people that offer me to sell it. To sell it. He hasn't even really tried to sell it. People have been offering him to sell it. Got it. So he doesn't. Been... Yeah, that makes sense. Offering him, but they're, they're not offering him what he wants. And I get it with the title V and everything, but, you know, it is what it is. Look at that property, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, and obviously, I mean, you're very interested. Obviously, um, you know, you you want it for a reason, whether it's to flip it or whatever. Um, there's a reason why you want it, and there's a reason he wants 120 for it. So, you know, if you can put 120 in his hand, that'd be great. Otherwise, I don't know what to tell you, honey. Okay. Is there a mortgage on the yeah. house? No, there's no mortgage on that, is there, John? No, no mortgage. Mm, okay. All right, cool. Well, yeah, I mean, at this point, I think I'm probably going to take my buyer's hat off because it just doesn't make too much sense for us to buy it at that number. But um, I mean, and maybe in in the future, he'd want to sell it to us. Maybe not. Well, not the only thing I can say is, you know, give him a call six months, a year, whatever it takes. Okay. Maybe he'll be more interested then. So it, it just sounds like he's he's not really too excited about selling it in general. He he wasn't thinking about listing it or anything like that at the moment. Exactly, exactly. Makes sense. He's not, he's not in a hurry. In a hurry. Got it. And the and the, and the tenants have been good to him. Yeah, he's got good tenants. Yeah. Love it. Okay. Well, thank you so much for being our mediator. You're the best. You're very welcome. You have a great day. Likewise. Bye bye. Bye bye. Like I was saying earlier, man, have fun with these calls. Y'all should be like up out of your seat, freaking throwing the tennis ball around in your office, like having fun. These seller calls should be fun. If this brought y'all any value, please like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'm out, y'all. Peace.